There is much to learn at the extremes, where expert drivers can handle what most drivers cannot. Our team is developing on-demand autonomy to prevent car crashes. Going autonomous. Temporarily giving an ordinary driver Whatever you're ready. the drifting skills of an expert. The hardest aspect of controlling a car is when it's drifting. My name is Avinash Balachandran and I lead the human-centric driving research team here at TRI. Our main goal is to learn how we can use advanced technologies to augment and amplify human drivers. I'm John Goh and I lead this project which focuses on autonomous driving at the limits of handling. We develop algorithms that can autonomously control the vehicle in critical limit handling situations. We want cars to have the skills of an expert driver and be able to correctly react to difficult situations like spinning when you hit a patch of ice. When you're drifting, there are a lot of forces at play and you've got to really understand how every degree of steering angle slows the car down or every additional application of throttle rotates the car. Being able to handle a drift requires being able to balance all of these different objectives up to the very limits of its capabilities. The vehicle is programmed to know where the obstacles are and where the track boundaries are. It's actually fully in control, even though it's doing a very aggressive and really hard to control maneuver. Every 20th of a second, it calculates a whole new trajectory to balance the car gracefully as it goes around the track. We are looking at how to control the car in the entire spectrum of its performance and then really build technologies that are not replacing humans, but rather incorporate expert driver skills into how regular drivers drive. When it all comes together and the car does something truly impressive, it really seems that we're getting a glimpse into the future. All right, John, reset. We're going to do this one more time. Mm -hmm.